hi guys welcome to my youtube channel uh, today i'm going to uh, create uh, some laravel uh, user login and registration form uh, yeah first uh, let's go to the laravel documentation site in here you can see i'm using laravel 8 and i will i'm using this starter kit as well uh, yeah uh, please use this documentation uh, as uh, uh, document uh, to create this uh, Laravel login uh, and registration uh, application. Okay, uh, first, uh, uh, first uh, we'll create our Laravel project. Okay, I will uh, create uh, my project within this directory. First, uh, I will open the command line interface, and here I will uh, uh, default. I will zoom this little bit. Uh, okay, now I will uh, create. I will uh, enter the uh, Laravel project uh, create uh, command. I will, uh, as you know that. Uh, I hope you guys know the uh, uh, how to create the Laravel project. I am not covering those things in with this video. Okay, I will add the uh, composer command. Composer create project laravel slash laravel let's say uh, user uh, application okay now it will take uh, uh, some times to install the laravel uh, project uh, and uh, you can see that uh, it will installing uh, that uh, libraries and those things symphony uh, libraries uh, it will take little time to install the okay now packages are installed installed dependencies okay now we have a brand new uh, project let's go to the project we have this project and uh, I will open this uh, from my IDE I will use uh, visual studio mm. not visual studio actually VS code uh, okay uh, okay now we have a brand new uh, Laravel application I will uh, first run this uh, uh, Laravel uh, server Okay. PHP artisan so okay I must I'll uh, open this port eighty thousand. Ah, okay, we already okay now you can see it is uh, we have a Laravel brand new Laravel project. Mm. Now I will, uh, as you can see here, we can't see any login uh, URL or registration URL uh, within the uh, right corner top. Uh, we can't see anything. Uh, let's uh, start our uh, developments. Actually, here we don't we don't have any code. Actually, I'm not going to uh, customize any co code in here. We just we have to run the. Uh, Laravel artisan commands to install the this registration form. It is uh, actually really easy. Uh, I will use um, uh, breeze, uh, breeze uh, uh, thing here. You can see composer require Laravel breeze dev. Uh, you can uh, see this. You can get more information using this document. It is actually starter kit. Uh, you can install uh, this and you can uh, generate uh, basic login form and registration with the database uh, uh, tables those things now I'm, I'm uh, run this command my second command level uh, artisan uh, breeze install it says uh, we have to uh, run these two commands okay I will add these commands to my uh, video description that you can easily uh, find those commands in here uh, you can see these commands 
I first install, uh, I will add this breeze to my composer first, uh, this command. Then after that, um, I will install, uh, uh, I will run this uh, second, as a second command, I run this command and also then third, uh, let's see other command also installing. Uh, Okay, now it's installed. Uh, yeah, uh, I have. I will finally run this one. No, no, this one. Now I have to run uh, uh, second command. Okay, now uh, I need to migrate. Uh, uh, next command is to migrate the, uh, the uh, to database. First, I have to create uh, some database. I will uh, create. Uh, database name called example login this is my database okay i will add the database to uh, env file within the data uh, env file we have to uh, configure our database information my username is root my pa uh, password is blank that means i don't have any password within my local environment now we can uh, uh, run uh, now we can run this uh, our migration scripts okay it says okay I didn't save the uh, env file now let's try oops okay I think uh, I, uh, I will Okay, let's run our migration. Okay, now I think uh, we can have brand new login form. Okay, here we have, uh, I hope you can see it here. We have uh, our login and registration uh, links in here with here. Once we click the uh, log login, we can see the login form. Uh, if we go to the registration, we can register. I will register as a um, test email, uh, let's say test Gmail, password 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And register. Okay, now I already registered. Uh, and registered and logged in here this is my dashboard uh, this is actually uh, without any coding we can uh, generate uh, user login form and registration form using the laravel um, starter kits uh, yeah after that we can uh, customize anything uh, within this uh, login uh, login and registration we can uh, according to our requirement we can customize everything we can uh, do uh, customization after according to our uh, requirement i'm not covering those things uh, with this video and uh, yeah i will uh, do those things with the different video and i hope you guys uh, understand the uh, laravel starter kit uh, and i think this video is useful thank you very much for watching my videos